Or sell my OG money. We'll see. So, what is up, my peeps? Today I'm going to be trying to do Boda Boda with my OG 200cc bike. Uh, I want to see how people will react. So I'm probably bound to be, to run into a few problems because uh, most of the people at the Boda Boda stage, they usually have some hierarchy that they follow. Where you probably have to pay to park at that spot to get some customers or you have to like get in line and they usually don't really then usually not really open to new folks unless you it'll take a lot of time to try and convince them to, uh, of what i'm doing even though i'm not actually doing it as a buddha buddha i'm just doing it for this video but they'll probably think that i'm trying to to steal their clients and the industry right now is actually not doing very well in terms of the buddha buddha perspective not from the manufacturer's perspective. Those guys are actually doing very well. So the the other problem is the the way my bike looks. It's probably not going to attract customers because they most of them will look at it and see that it's like a more private bike than a border border. But I'll I'll do my best to get clients and see if I won't sleep hungry today. So, yeah, keep you posted. So what is going to happen, I'm going to go look for a spot where no one is going to disturb me and then park there for a while and see if someone, if someone is going to, going to show up. I actually called one of my friends who has another housing warrior just like mine. I think he should be about there. There he is. Yeah, I was going to do this to two of us and see how this goes. Uh, the two of us are probably going to call more attention on us, so I thought that would be better for us. What is up, my peeps? <laughs> I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to do it. I don't know how and see if we are going to be rich today. The biggest game kwa hii kitu ni kungojea. Ah, baby. What's up? Yeah, I'm going to kisha place hapa hapa. Eh, unafikiri sisi ni boda boda? Eh, boda boda. Sawa. Eh, unafika wapi? Nafika boost. Eh, boost na sapa. Si 50 bob ni sawa 100. 50 bob. 100. Eh, mmeota toa. Let's go, let's go. So that took quite a while. What I'm doing, Moses. Let's go, man. If I get a sport bike here, ah, this is a shock to the end of Haraka, son. Your Mona Shinrei 400. So that's probably the next bike. Never. Sasa hatukua tumuongea kwenda na kurudi Sasa hibari tokuwa miya mwa tuongeza Haa, ukiongeza msini nisawadi Since you are basically umepanda marambili Hainaji ya nukunyonge Rolling up over black Cadillac High heel boots and a sexy body full of tats 
Baby's bad, oh baby's had a bad After her there ain't no coming back Wanna take a run at that I think she's feeling me So we have decided that we're going to look for more people along the freeway Because while parking you don't really get You don't really get that many people So people along this freeway are usually way more Way less reluctant to, to board on on, on strange looking bikes i.e. those that are not border borders so if i get someone waiting for my tattoo i'm going to try and negotiate for them to to have one uh, if it works then well and good i see someone let us see what happens that's going to be like my second client today. Sasa? Uh, Uba nangadu eh? Eh? Fifty bob? Eh, that's what you're asking? Eh, that's what you're asking? Eh? Ah, that's what I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. And we go. Are you sure you are going to to the house? Yes, I am going to to the house. Ah, So if we do one like this, we are probably going to be spending more time riding than actually getting clients, I don't know. This is probably going to be harder than I thought. But as much as people on these freeways will be compliant to, to riding, to, to boarding, I don't see like there are that many. So I'm probably going to get like one more or two and then see what's next. Ah, uh, baby boss, when I have it, eh, oh, when I got between the fifty, I'm here, eh, seventy. I thought I did, you know, eh, could you guess it? Eh, could you guess it? Eh, you could do that. What do you want to say? Nambio, what do you want to say? Get Nambio. So, so, so we are still on the hunt for customers. 
Let us see, let us see what we can do. I've been told that this side is actually very, very fertile. Uh, I'm talking about it has a lot of people who actually do good about that here. So I'm probably going to get a lot more people. Mm, what else? That's a lot of wood and wood. It's about to give you problems. So I'm going to stop here. Oh, you have stolen my customer. Who oh, yes, else is doing my help? I'm at this moment to be good for free, sir. I eat a quite rice, you must What should we do? I want to be better to live with a number. I'm going to go to the car. 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 Yeah, the the border border life in Kenya is is actually doing quite well. If we look at official sites from 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 the dealers' point of view, in fact, they're doing so well that they don't need any marketing. Even punks like us who do good reviews and actually get a decent amount of views, we are not required in this industry. Yeah, I guess mostly it's because uh, regular Joes are actually able to acquire these bikes, even if they make no money. What the hell is going on? Yeah, like I was saying, many, many, many regular Joes are actually able to acquire these bikes, regardless of the marketing. Probably because I believe most of the word goes around through word of mouth and not really social media marketing because these guys put their content on useless things like Facebook and get like 20 views and no one sees them so I really don't believe it's marketing that's just how deeply how well deeply rooted this Boda Boda industry is in in this country about 1.4 million motorcycles are registered by 2018 and about 700,000 per month register motorcycles and almost all of them are border border riders. Private riders like us are actually very few yeah, and those statistics obviously don't carry everyone because I believe most of these people don't really go through the official channels to register. Most bikes are actually bought second hand which is something that I actually encourage because the new ones are actually very expensive. The only problem with second hand is it's almost impossible to pay in installments like the new ones because they you have to give them guarantee and stuff yeah so the industry is doing well but uh, most of the border border actually tell me that they're not doing as well as good because uh, the competition is too much right now there's over a hundred bikes here in, in Egerton and Jor at uh, in one stage you can find up to 50 bikes so that's not really good but the companies really don't care. So let's go and continue with this hustle. Sasa, what are you doing? I'm going to go to the house. Yes. 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 Ah, so we are going to be able to find it. But you will do it. Shapa India. Right. 
Kau macam apa? Mana kat sini? Sudah kau ini. Kau tak pernah nak kawan lagi macam boleh boleh, eh? Ah. So I am done with the Boda Boda life for today. It is not as easy. It's not really hard, but but the problem is the problem is uh, the number of clientele that I need to be to have. It's not such a small number, so I would have to do this thing for like the whole day for it to be sustainable. Yeah, the, the nonsense I've done today isn't enough. Plus, I would need uh, I would need what uh, shorter distances to charge more money because mine doesn't really mine doesn't really consume like this 150 cc that 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 uh, are prevalent in this road the 150 cc is actually very fuel economic some of them are even 125 or 100 cc mine does around 40 kilometers per liter though do around 45 ish and if you drive like a good student like a good like a, if you ride like a good rider then it could give you 50 kilometers per liter. That small margin is more than enough to give you the extra, the extra money. Yeah, so 
I believe of that for today. Losing time, I'm fading fast. I just wanna make it last. Try to let go of the past. I close my eyes and face the blast. Sleepless nights and headaches start. Restlessness to hell and back. What's my purpose? What do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack. And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief This guy doesn't like riding with his helmet on He says he hates it We're broken, it's tragic We're not all elastic But maybe there's magic Believe you could have it And I know of sadness The anxious and panic The infinite vastness of all that is blackness <laughs>